Hi guys, this is Nancy with Life's Blessings. Visit my blog at www.lifesblessings101.wordpress.com. Go ahead and subscribe to our channel if you have not already. If you have, then I thank you so much. We need all the subscribers we can get. That would really help us out. Give us a thumbs up right now on this video if you enjoy book flip throughs, whether it be homeschool curriculum, whether it be a new devotional book, whether it be um, just a great read aloud, library hauls, if you enjoy Dollar Tree hauls, if you enjoy grocery hauls, please go ahead and subscribe, tap that bell to get the notifications. Here we go. This is an I Wonder Ocean book. We are going to be using this to supplement our science this year for first grade and pre-K. We do science and history together with our children, both of them at the same time. Just kill two birds with one stone there. I'm going to have to turn the book around. There we go. If I'm going too fast, feel free to pause. If I'm going too slow, feel free to fast forward. This, of course, was not written in a Christian worldview, and yes, I am a Christian homeschool mom. So, how do I deal with that? I skip over some parts. Sometimes I go ahead and read it. Sometimes I read it, and then I bring out the Word of God and show the difference. I don't think anything in here would be outrageous for Christians, but, you know... Each, each of us have our own beliefs, so who knows? So if you're here for the first time, yes, we are Christians, and yes, we do use I Wonder and Us Born. Sorry if that bothers you. I know that's offensive to a lot of people. There's a lot of comments online about it. Guess what, people? I don't care. I am me. You are you. You have your own view. I have mine. I respect you. Please respect me. I have my reasons. You have yours. Our children love science. These have been wonderful to us. We have not started in these I Wonder books yet, but we have began one of the Us Barn books, and that is the Encyclopedia of Animals the first encyclopedia of animals and I say that wrong every single time I do apologize my kids are quite advanced for their age especially in math and science and so these have been awesome for us just doing a science curriculum usually is not enough and if I haven't mentioned it in this video because I don't know I am recording a lot of videos at one time and simply uploading them on different dates. So, if I haven't mentioned in this video, we are using ACSI Purposeful Design Science Level 1 with our first grade boy and pre-K girl. So, that's what we are using for 2019-2020 if you are interested. As soon as we get it in the mail, then I will do a flip through of it as well. Please check out our other videos where I have done other curriculum reviews and flip throughs. And if you want to know the rest of the curriculum we will be using, I have a first grade curriculum choices video and a pre-K curriculum choices video that you can go check out. I will try to link it below if I remember and have a moment to do so. This is your index and we are done with this book, but do not go away because we have another book. That was the Ocean book from I Wonder and now we're going to do Whales and Dolphins. If you're enjoying this, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel. If you've already subscribed, I thank you so much. This is the contents of this one. I'm sorry, you didn't see the bottom there. There you go. 
a mammal, not a fish. Again, these books do not have a Christian worldview, so there may or may not be things inside that do not align with God's word. If there are any such things inside, I will likely skip over them or go ahead and read them and then pull out God's word and show the difference. But since mine are really small, my children are really small, I will likely just skip over them for now. Of course, these are books that you can hold on through the years and read them continuously with your children. It's not necessary to just use them one time and done. That is my plan. Thank you so much for staying with us, for watching this video. Thank you so much for your attention. We've gotten several new subscribers lately, and I want to tell you thank you so much for your support. Thank you for your tips, your advice, your comments. Continue to give us thumbs up on the videos that you enjoy. That way I will know which videos to make more of. Like I say, we do Dollar Tree hauls. We do grocery hauls, mostly from Walmart. Sometimes from other places. We just don't have all those nice stores where I live. I kind of live out in the country, so. Walmart is one of the cheapest ones that we have around here, so that's what I have to deal with. I've never even been to Aldi. I would love to go to Aldi. I have seen so many wonderful videos of grocery hauls from Aldi, and I have one probably about 15, 20 miles from here. So one day I will try it out. And maybe I will do an Aldi haul one day. As of right now, no. <laughs> Not driving all the way over there to buy groceries for my little bitty family. I only have two kids right now. Praying for God's direction in that. I will not be having any more natural children, but praying for God's direction for possible adoption. Pray with us for that. So that was the I Wonder Ocean book, Wells and Dolphins, and me rambling. Thank you so much for tuning in. God bless you. Take care. And I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then give us a thumbs up. Sorry if you don't like me rambling. It's what I do because I'm just not going to be silent while we're looking at pages. Anyway, God bless. Take care. Give us a thumbs up. Like and subscribe. Share with your friends. And stay cool. It is hot outside. Drink water. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. Bye-bye.